this is a Sony Vegas tutorial I'm going to teach people how to split screen the best way to use split screen with two videos playing at the same time so let's get started let's have bring our projects in our video files simply go into file go into import press media now the idea now is find the clips you want so I've got a few clips saved in there one minute what I normally do as well, find two of the old clips, what I'm going to work with, highlight them both. Now it's just simpler. Let them come into your project area. Click outside the box. Bring the first video in. And bring the second video in. Just widen this to the third, fourth layer. Same with this one, keep them level now I always get rid of the sound because I'm going to play some music on this but you don't have to get rid of the sound but I prefer it to play my music now to get one layer to another simply highlight the layer use your mouse, hold your mouse and drag up that brings them both together now to get the split screen effect we'll try and make this bit smaller Simply go into your crop panel, which is this here, it shows you event crop panel. Click onto it. As you can see now, we're at the events crop panel. The way to do this split screen, when it, when it says width, it says nine, nine, 1920. We need to double up, times that by two. So what we'll do, get the calculator out. what I normally do oh not working properly what I normally do go for the calculator there we go calculator's out just type in 920 that's 1920 times 2 equals now we know it's 3840 so it's 3840 click on there, I always copy this first because we're going to need it later use the calculator 380 just type in 3840 3840 press return on the keyboard the reason I copied the 920 or the 1920 because it goes into this one double click highlight control V paste in Press return on the keyboard. Now, now we've got settings for the first slide. We can just call this slide split. Why we do this? Because it will save the settings for the next slide. Press save. Now that it should be saved. On the next video, go into a crop panel again. Bring it up to the next video up here as we saved the split for the first one find it scroll down where it says split now the settings should be saved the key is now when it's X center double click this is the most important bit press zero not enter now that gives you the split screen come out of it and we have a split screen press play as you can see now they are both playing at the same time that is the best way in Sony Vegas to do a split screen it's so simple and easy to do if you want to add some music to it stop the stop the videos go back to the beginning go into file import and just look for some particular music you have. I always keep mine in downloads. So go into my PC, download. This is where I keep my music, so yours could be in a different place. Try any one. Let's try this one. Bring it in. I always put my music down to the bottom. Scroll the music. Make it all level. You can even widen it out by using your mouse 
the wheel just move the wheel I'll just press play and you should have a split screen two videos playing at the same time with a bit of funky music try it with some different music to move anything from your project highlight it right click on the mouse press remove from project let's bring some more music in again press file import media let's try the chemical one bring it in press play <laughs> So you do split screen and Sony Vegas. Thanks for watching. On the next video, I'll show you how to render for YouTube or the internet or any different formats. But the ones these will be going on to YouTube, so I'll show you the best settings to render on YouTube by the internet. Thanks for watching. See you again.